Unit 5. Part 1. Look at the picture. Now listen and look. This is an example. Hello. Is Mark at the zoo today? Yes, he is. I think he's sitting at the table. Is he wearing a green T-shirt? No, that's his friend Todd. Mark is wearing a blue T-shirt. Yes, I can see him now. He's eating his lunch. That's right. Can you see the line? Now listen and draw lines. One. Look at Alex. I can't see him. Where is he? He's next to the monkeys. Has he got a camera? Yes. He's taking pictures of the monkeys. That's good. He loves taking pictures. Two. Where's Daisy? She's under the tree. Which tree? There are two trees in the picture. Daisy is under the tree on the left. Oh, yes. Is she drinking apple juice? No, she's drinking lemonade. Three. Where's Peter? Can you see him? What's he wearing today? A yellow shirt, I think. Yes, Peter likes yellow. There he is, next to the monkeys. Oh, yes. He's giving a banana to the monkeys. Four. Is that Lisa under the tree on the right? Sitting on the grass? Yes. What's she doing? She's reading a map. Oh. Where does she want to go? To see the crocodiles. Five. Is Laura at the zoo today? Yes. She's wearing a blue T-shirt and a red skirt. Where? I can't see her. She's looking at the lions. Oh, yes. I can see her now. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the example. Look and listen. Hello, Susan. Can I ask you some questions? OK. What's your family name? My family name's Palmer. Susan Palmer. Can you spell that, please? Yes. It's P-A-L-M-E-R. Thank you. Can you see the answer? Susan's family name is Palmer. Now listen and write. 1. Have you got a friend at school? Yes. She's called Rachel. She's my best friend. Rachel? How do you spell that? R-A-C-H-E-L. OK. 2. Is Rachel that girl with the curly hair? Yes, she's got long, curly hair. That's right, she's got beautiful hair. Three. Are you and Rachel in the same class? Yes, we sit together. Which class is that? 12B. It's next to the library. Four. Do you and Rachel like reading, then? Oh, yes. We read a lot of comics. Do you get them from the school library? No. We buy them together. Five. 
What do you do after school? We go to our dancing class. Every day? No, only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. That is the end of part two. Part three. Look at the pictures. Listen and look. This is an example. What did Mike do last week? Where were you on Monday, Mike? I was at home. Were you with your dad? No, I was with my friend. We watched a video. Was it a good film? Yes, it was about a monster. I loved it. Can you see the word Monday? On Monday, Mike watched a video with his friend. Now listen and write the days. One. What did you do on Tuesday? I went to the park with your mum and dad. No, with my brother and sister. Did you play soccer? No, we had a picnic. I ate a lot of sandwiches. Two. What about Friday? What did you do then? I don't know. Oh yes, I was at home. Did you watch TV? No, I cooked supper for mum and dad. Really? What did you cook? Chicken and rice. They said it was very good. Three. Did you go to the beach on Sunday? No, I didn't. I was at home. What did you do? It was my birthday, so we had a party. Oh, I see. How old are you now? Seven. I had a big birthday cake. Four. What about Saturday? Oh yes, I went to the park again. Did you play basketball? No, I went horse riding. Oh, I love horses. Five. And what did you do on Wednesday? I think I was at home. Yes, that's right. Did you do your homework? No, I had a music lesson. Oh, do you play the guitar? No, I play the piano. I have a lesson every week. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the pictures. Listen to the example. What did Steve eat for breakfast? Did Steve eat bread and eggs for breakfast? No, he ate fruit. He always eats fruit for breakfast. Yes, but what fruit? Bananas. He doesn't like bananas. He ate an orange. Can you see the tick? Steve had an orange for breakfast. Now listen and tick the box. One. Where did Jane go on holiday? Did Jane go on holiday? Yes, she went last week. Did she go to the beach? No, she went to see her grandparents. Do they live in a town? No, they live on a farm in the country. That's good. It's beautiful in the country. Two. What did Kim's dad buy for her? Look at Kim's dad. He's carrying a bag. Yes, he bought something for Kim. It's her eighteenth birthday today. Oh, did he buy her a watch? No, he bought her a dress. Is it red? No, it's blue.
Blue is Kim's favorite color. Three. Which one is Sally? Look, can you see my friend Sally? No, I can't. Is she wearing trousers? No, she's wearing a green skirt. Has she got long blonde hair? No, she's got short brown hair. Oh yes, I can see her now. Four. What did Tom give Jill? It was Jill's birthday yesterday. Oh, what did you buy her? I bought her a book and some flowers. What about Tom? What did he buy for Jill? He bought her a new bag. Oh, good. She needed a new bag for school. Five. What are they having for supper? What do you want for supper, Dan? I'd like a burger. And what does Simon want? He wants chicken, but I don't like chicken. Why don't we have fish then? That's a good idea. I'll tell Simon. That is the end of part four. Part five. Look at the picture. Listen to the example. Can you see the birds above the trees? Yes, there are two. Well, color the birds brown. Okay, the birds above the trees, brown. Can you see the brown birds? Now listen and color and draw. One. Can you see the two girls running in the playground? Yes, a tall girl and a short girl. That's right. I want you to color the taller girl's trousers. Okay. What color? Purple. Color them purple. The taller girl's trousers, purple. Okay. Two. Can you see the cloud? Yes, it's next to the kite. Yes, that's right. Color it grey. A grey cloud. Okay. Good. Three. Now you can color again. Good. I like coloring. Can you see the girl flying a kite? Yes, I can see her. Shall I color the kite? No. Color her dress. What color? Blue. A blue dress for the girl flying a kite. Four. There are two boys listening to the radio. Yes, I can see them. One is sitting and one is standing. Yes, color the one who's sitting. Color his trousers yellow. Yellow trousers. Okay. Five. Now you can draw. Oh, good! What shall I draw? Can you see the boy who's wearing shorts? Yes. He's sad. He needs something to play with. That's right. Draw a ball next to him. A ball? That's good. Shall I color it red? Yes. Color the ball next to the boy, red.